Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. Uh, so first things first is the Herbal Essences, the Sleeker, the Butter. This is a shampoo. Um, I just have the shampoo. I didn't pick up the conditioner because you guys know what my favorite conditioner is. Um, this has Kupasu, what is it? It says Kupasu, yeah. Kupasu um, Butter Essences in it. It looks like this. Um, the actual product um, is like a peachy shade and it smells so good. Like if you like those vanilla warm scents, You'll really, really like this. And it was only like $3. So uh, these are light. They don't say anything on the front, but it's all on the back. Um, so these are from Graders, uh, just because they're not specifically this brand, but this is the chocolate-covered espresso beans. Um, and this bag lasted me literally three days. And there are apparently four servings in this bag. And I ate them all. Fresh Water Mist Antibacterial Dental Foaming Hand Soap. And this is the... Ulta brand. They have really good stuff here. Um, I really like their antibacterial soaps. This had a nice fresh scent to it with a tiny bit of floral to it, but um, not too much of that. It was just very fresh. And for some reason, I got a floral note, and I could be totally insane. Um, but Ulta does a lot of deals where it's like buy two, get three free, or something like that. So be on the lookout, or is it like buy two, get two free? Sometimes they'll do buy two, get three free. I have seen that before. But this was a really good foaming cleanser. I've talked about that before. My boyfriend's Old Spice Dry Skin Defense Body Wash Cleaning Hydration um, in Live Wire. And again, he bought a new body wash. Um, and he just was like, I'm done with this. So I was like, well, I'm going to talk about it. So I have used this myself personally, and I actually do like it. My boyfriend really, really enjoys this as well. It's very nice and very, like, silky. Um, this is kind of like Dove for Men, um, but I'm sure they have Dove for Men, but this is kind of like that, you know what I'm saying? Um, this is in Live Wire. So Live Wire smells, oh my god. But it smells like... Just very manly. There's nothing... I don't know. No, I don't know. I don't know exactly what this smells like, but it's just very manly. Almost kind of like Fiji a little bit, if you guys know of Fiji. I used my last contact, and I have a question for you guys. This is actually, like, I need to know information. So this is the AccuView Oasis um, contact lenses for astigmatism with hydroclear plus in them. I don't really know if any of that was important. This was for my left eye. I know the astigmatism part was important and so is the brand. I need to purchase these, um, but I can't find anywhere that has these. And this is my deodorant, um, the Suave 24 hour protection in sweet pea and violet. And this is an invisible solid, um, or so they say, if you're wondering what those black spots are, it's from a face mask in here. Um, no, they're not. They are not an invisible solid whatsoever. Um, this actually is just, I don't like the quality of, so I'm actually throwing this away because I just know it's going to get dried out and it won't last since I pushed all the product up to the top. So this is a Freeman's Charcoal and Black Sugar Mud Mask and it smooths, purifies, and moisturizes your skin. And these are like a dollar something at Walmart, Target, wherever you can find these little packets. And they actually have a lot of uses in them. Um, I think I'm going to talk about another one. Oh, I think I might be talking about two more. They have a lot of uses in them. This one still has a lot of product left in it because I pushed it all the way to the top and then I couldn't get it back down. So it's just going to get dried and it's going to be pointless for me to keep because it was literally all of it. This was so nice. Um, just a nice, thick, consistency mud mask. I used it this morning and it after I was done, it made my skin feel nice and tight. So I knew it was like working to an extent, you know what I'm saying? Um... So I feel very moisturized and I love the way my skin looks. If you guys notice a difference, it's probably because of this because I honestly just used it because I just took a shower this morning. So I used it after my shower, which is why I like to do a lot of the times with face masks. The um, Freeman's Facial Purifying Clay Mask in Akai. Um, this helps to clear pores and soothe your skin. I really liked the scent of this. By the way, let's back up a second. The scent of this reminds me of fresh baby wipes. Okay, so this product here, the the Akai face mask, I really liked as well. It was nice and hydrating as well. Um, it felt a little bit different than the mud mask. It wasn't as intense. And my face, my skin didn't feel as tight or anything like that. Um, but it it was nice. It was just great to just relax in the tub in, and it had a nice light fruity scent, which was great. 
And then this one is my favorite out of all of those, but I would definitely repurchase all, um, all of these again. Um, the Honeydew and Chamomile Sleeping Mask um, for dry skin, and it deeply hydrates your skin overnight. So it's a very thin mask, but because, um, I mean, you put it on at night, you're sleeping in it. It's just a very thick moisturizer, um, and this smells so good. Please, scent, come back to me. It just smells like honeydew. It honestly smells like honeydew. Um, it has a nice relaxing feeling. It feels kind of just really nice on the skin. I can't even tell you guys. Um, however, the scent sometimes can affect my eyes a little bit if I accidentally get it too close up under my eyes. So I like to avoid the under eye area anyway. Um, but sometimes if I get it too close, it will start, my eyes will kind of water. They won't burn, they'll just water, and I know it's the scent, so I have to kind of like wipe it away. But I really love it. It's great. really helps to moisturize the skin. It's amazing. I honestly recommend it to you guys. I don't even think I would pay for a Laneige um, Sleeping Water Mask, I believe is what it's called. I think I would always stick to this because this has both of these. I used um, all of the product and, you know, as much as I could get out of these little packets. And it... There was five use. There was ten uses of this one, and there were five uses of this one. So this is to remove my makeup with just quickly. These are just little baby wipes, and these are the Lullabies baby wipes um, that you can get from Aldi's, and they're 84 cents a package, and you get 56 wipes. They feel very towelette like. They're nice and large, nice and stretchy, and nice and like wet, and they do remove waterproof mascara and everything like that. It's insane. So I really do recommend these if you do just want something to clean your face before you put makeup on or just to kind of quickly um, get rid of your makeup before you wash your face or something like that. These are really, really good. And my boyfriend has another deodorant because he had like a stash of deodorant and he was carrying them in his bag to work. So this is the Old Spice Wolf Thorn Antiperspirant and Deodorant. This came in a set when he got it around Christmas time with the body wash. The body wash is a no-go. It smells like B.O. in a bottle. Girl, it smells like B.O. in a bottle. Mmm. I do not like that in the body wash form. It smells like B.O. It smells like barf. It's so gross. But in this form here... It smells so good and so, what is that? It's a fruit. I just got it. Oh my God. I can see it in my head. Citrus and orange. There we go. It smells very orangey and citrusy. You guys are like, uh, she's losing it. <laughs> no, it smells very citrusy and it's really good. So he likes this one and this is a solid as well, but it is actually invisible. So I'm about to just switch over to the boys. Another one of my boyfriend's uh, perfume sprays. Why do I call them that? They're colognes. Gizmo, you want some? Um, this is number 1977 from American Eagle, um, and it's just an aerosol spray can. He likes these a lot better than cologne or anything like that. I mean, he likes cologne too, but he likes these a lot better than, like, sprays. Um, I don't even know if they make sprays for men. Do they? I don't know. <laughs> um... We have, we can have stuff like this, we have sprays, and then we have perfume, and then we have, like, who the hell knows what else, you know what I'm saying? And then guys have, like, body spray and cologne. That's it. Um, but I think this costs, like, five bucks or something like that. I think they had a deal. Um, he has, he's had it for probably a year. Um, yeah, it's just air now. It smells so good. It reminds me of him. So, um, he really likes this, and I definitely recommend it, because it does stay, um, around for a very long time. A Chinchilla, empty and favorite, is their, um, these are by KT, they're Chili Chews Mineral Treats, and they look like little ice cream cones, and they, you get three of them for like three to four dollars or something like that. Um, they're not only for chinchillas though, they are for guinea pigs, hamsters, rabbits, or other small animals. Um, normally I don't like to buy things that don't say that they're, um, for chinchillas, but I couldn't resist. They looked like little ice cream cones, and he actually does eat them. Um, and they just taste like chalk. I was dared to lick one before I gave one to Kuali, and it just tastes like chalk. So I absolutely love, and I got face mask all over it. Uh, um, this is, let me just clean this off, you guys. Okay, so this is my amazing... Did I just touch it? Okay, so this is the My Amazing Blow Dry Secret Quick Dry Shake and Spray. So this is just a sample. They 
obviously come in a larger size. I had gotten this when I worked at a salon as a sample and I was just like, whatever, I'll try it. And this is actually really, really good. It smells like baby powder. So if you don't like that scent, you won't like this at all. Like if it makes you so vile that you can't use this, that's the only reason you shouldn't be using it. How long does it take you girls to blow dry your hair? If you have long hair, if you have thick hair, forever. You know what I'm saying? So, like, I mean, I always like to wait a little bit. Like, as soon as I get to the shower, I don't, like, go and blow dry my hair or anything. Because if I did, I would be standing there for an hour. And I don't have very long hair, like you guys can see. But... I wait probably 10 to 20 minutes after I get out of the shower, um, and then right before I blow dry, I just spray this in and whatever else I want, and literally cuts my time in half. Um, even before, I would wait 10 to 20 minutes before I blow dry my hair, um, and I would still be there for like probably 40 minutes for this hair. For this. Like, really? This is what I used a lot of the time when I do acrylic nails, and I used this back in school. This actually came in our kit. This is the OPI Absolute Crystal Clear um, powder, and it's it's all gone. There's literally little balls of acrylic in the bottom. Um, yeah, it's all gone. They're just like balls of acrylic in there. Um, I have a really hate love relationship. Lo hate love? Love hate relationship um, with this with this whole absolute line by OPI. The monomer, um, the liquid, just mixed with this, like, they don't last as long. You prime your nails, you apply this, it just doesn't last as long as the CND powder that I use. So, from Lollipop Bubbles, I did a video, and I'll link it down below for you guys, um, introducing the new scents that she had, um, stocked or whatever or was going to start carrying, I believe. I'm not exactly sure at this moment, but I, I did say it in the video. So the video will be linked down below if you guys want to go check it out. But she is just an Etsy shop, and she's one of my really good friends here on YouTube, and I freaking love her. She does have a channel. She's starting, I think she's starting to try it back up again. Um, but this is Serendipity Cookies, and this smells so good. This just smells like Amish country to me. Um, it's very sweet and very warm. It's very good. I really actually like it a lot. So this is what, they don't come in this, this is just a sample that I had gotten from her. They come in more of a bigger body butter tub. So really, really like those. Keep doing what you're doing, Dawn. I have actually used up this whole bottle of Killer Queen by Katy Perry. And my little, my little thing fell off. There's a thing on top of here. Um, I love this scent. It's great. It's so, come on, oh, there's nothing in here. I'm trying to spray it. Okay. You, literally, there's nothing in there, Emily. I don't know if you guys can see. I mean, there's like the tiniest amount in there, and I can't get it out. I love the way that this bought. I love the way that it smells. I love the way that it looks. Um, I don't have like the blue one. I would like to get it because I'm just like a perfume junkie. Like, I just want to buy all of the perfumes in the world because uh, I love them. I love the way bottles look. That just makes me super happy. Um, but yeah, I really like the scent. It was great for nighttime. I wore it all the time. It was just very musky. And just a great nighttime scent. This is the um, Soft Lips Cube. I don't know what they call them. They call them anything else? Soft Lips Cube in Vanilla Bean. And my little guy, he's all gone. It's normally like a domed shape. I I really like it. I like the scent. They're nice and moisturizing. I don't like to put my fingers in it, so I'm just going to throw it away. Um, because it just scratches up against my lips but these were really good I think they retail for like 250 or something like that but they're so much better than EOS um, I left my nail glue like my cap wouldn't stay on and I had it in my purse it's all dried up my nail glue that I use is the crazy glue craft glue and it's literally exactly the same as nail glue I actually have an empty here this is a old Bic um head that this is what I this is my favorite one this is my favorite I can't get it out um, guy razor. They look like this. They have like the orange like top and bottom and they're gray. This is my favorite one. So those, those are good. Those are the best guy razors. I like really love them. I've used like five. Actually, I really like the Gillette ones with the metal handles, but my legs can't have such great quality.
quality stuff sometimes. Alright you guys, so if you enjoyed this video, please give it a huge thumbs up. Also, um, let me know in the comments where you know of to buy prescription contact lenses. And also tell me what your favorite deodorant is. And let me know about the Absolute OPI powder. And I will see you guys next time. Bye guys.